today, we're going to be using my brand new waffle iser, the Power XL stuffed waffle iser. We're going to make some blueberry stuffed waffles. It's going to be exciting. So we're going to start with our blueberry pie filling. So I have a pan full of blueberries. I'm going to add some sugar. I'm going to add some cornstarch. I'm going to cook it up so it's nice and pie filling. I think I'm doing this wrong. Okay, I think it might need water. <laughs> On blueberries. Turn in the pie filling. We're gonna stir these till it looks like pie filling. Maybe mash a couple for kicks. Look at this go. Oh, this is gonna be a tasty blueberry waffle treat. It's like that pie filling from a can, but it's no can, it's Chef Calvin. Chef Calv can. Oh, so this is looking pretty good. It's getting a little smoky, so I think it's done. Not quite sure. Yeah, that should be good. Oh, look at how blue that looks. So this is what we're gonna put inside of our waffles. So now that that's done, let's get started on this batter. I need one of you guys to read me the recipe. Okay, um, me too. In a large bowl, whisk together that. the flour, sugar, baking powder, baking soda, and salt. Okay, how much of those things do I need? Does it, does it stack? Um, one three fourths cup all flour. Shit sizzle, bro. I know. Shit's a like potatoes. <laughs> I know. But it's blueberries. <laughs> One and three fourths cup, you said? Yeah. How many waffles is this thing? I don't know. <laughs> it's just some ingredients. <laughs> Sounds good. Yeah. Does this look like three fourths of this thing? Yeah. No, it's a little more, don't you think? Yeah, that's better, probably. Yeah, that's probably. Yeah, that's good. Yeah, I think that's perfect. I think I nailed that. Two? Uh, yeah. So I'm going to use the one fourth, guys, so I'm going to go four scoops. Uh, one and three fourths baking powder. One and three fourths? Yeah. Okay, what's next? Uh, one fourth teaspoon baking soda. Are you stealing my show? No. <laughs> it's my show, and even, even though it's my show, it can't be your episode. <laughs> <laughs> okay, what else? Uh, one fourth teaspoon salt. Oh no, you're spilling things. Someone's gonna be mad at me. Uh, yeah. So just whisk them together, I and then that. afterwards. Uh, you already whisked it, right? Yeah, that's good. Okay. Uh, in a medium bowl, whisk together the buttermilk, eggs, and vanilla. Oh, I need another bowl? Yeah. So how much of the buttermilk, eggs, and vanilla do I need? Uh, buttermilk, you're going to use one, three, four cup. Okay. Uh, then you're going to add... Eggs. Two large eggs. Ooh, see that crack? There it is. Awesome. <laughs> I cannot find it. What's it say? Uh, two teaspoons. TBSP? Yeah. That's a lot. Of, that's too much. Boss call is going to get made. <laughs> oh shit. Oh, 
Oh no. Oh no. I'm gonna have to clean that up. This is gonna be no sell. <laughs> like when LeBron went to Miami. Well, that went well for him, but like geographically, he wouldn't sell. And it says whisk this together? <laughs> yeah, you whisk that together. And then after you whisk that, you whisk it into the other one. Oh, can I get the whole thing going? Yeah. Okay, so now I combine these? Yeah. And that's it? You combine them and then you whisk them? Yeah. Ooh. Here's the big pour. How long am I supposed to whisk this? It doesn't say, it just says, uh, until battery is, until a battery is formed. A battery or batter? Batter. Okay. So I'm not putting no Duracells in my food. <laughs> uh, so, it says, um, make sure you put, uh, like a, um, cooking spray. And I'll say cooking spray onto the pan. Oh yeah, and I was then, gonna forget that. Yeah, and then afterwards you can do anywhere between one third to three fourths of a cup. Uh, the batter is the thing. Just says make sure like you don't fill up too much. They, the they think I'm using a normal waffle iron. <laughs> I got the Power XL stuffed waffleizer. Cool. So things are gonna be a little bit different with this bad boy. So I got the stuffed waffleizer. So I'm gonna go down with a layer of batter. It's already cooking, so yeah, hurry up. Looks like enough, and then we're gonna go on with some more batter. Shut the lid of the waffleizer and let it work. <laughs> I overfilled the waffle. It's pouring out. Can't even move with you reaching over me. <laughs> you gotta get the perfect shot, man. <laughs> I gotta get the perfect waffle. This, this might be far from that, but we'll see. Apple. Yeah, it's an ass scene on TV product. I thought it would work better. I guess this is my fault, but whatever. So, it's about time, I think. <laughs> Are you okay? <laughs> what happened? <laughs> I think it's waffle time. <laughs> I'm a man that's learned from my mistakes. I bounced back from the pork chop explosion. I can bounce back from the waffle explosion. Let's just put that in and hope for the best. Try two. Third time's a charm. So um, this time I'm gonna do a thin layer on the whole bottom, I think. Get some of that blueberry goodness in the middle. Get it all on the top. Cover that blueberry completely. Drop the top and let it work. Whew. Okay, so let one. I'm gonna plate up some of the waffles that I've scalvaged. So as you can see, I have, I have one waffle. <laughs> Who won switch plate? I want the red. Wow, thanks, man. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, which one do you want? We need syrup. I'll take the yellow. Oh, Chef Callan only eats all the red plate. Once again, we have vacated the kitchen or the yard, and I'm about to dig into this waffle. It's surprisingly good. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, good boy. Wow. Syrupy. Kind of crispy. Pretty good. Blueberry pie filling tastes kind of bland, but the waffle's good. 
I think it's good on my side. I had a lot more blueberry. Yeah, Overall, it's a good waffle. Mm -hmm. What do you rate it, Calvin? It's really good. I think this is an eight for us. An eight? Yeah. Are we scaling it out of ten? Yeah. What about you? Eight. And I'll rate it an eight as well. Yeah. Okay. Now time to check on our waffle. Uh oh. Here we go again. Who even knows why it's doing this at this point? <laughs> I think this is the product's fault, not mine. I think so too.